kitty and we are in my new I don't know what to call this YouTube studio my new studio where I will be or we will be filming most of our sit down videos ignore the double door behind me this is the background I'm using today I'm actually filming about three videos today and so this is the background that you guys are gonna see and um, we're actually gonna be working in this room this is that's not what this video is all about but I'm just gonna go over it real quick we're going to be working on this room and I need to paint a wall and that will be my future background so it's gonna be much better than this I'm also working on my lighting so please excuse me if the lighting is in the best so today's video is a skincare video oh and check out my <laughs> Christmas shirt it isn't Christmas obviously we're in November but it was cold today today it actually is 54 degrees that's too cold so really quickly I'm gonna go over um, some people have asked me for a skincare routine video that is for like dark circles um, right now I don't know if you can tell on camera but I have been having trouble sleeping so I've been getting dark circles um, but the skincare routine that I'm actually going to show you guys is going to be perfect for anyone with acne problems um, anybody that wants to get rid of their dark circles, uh, bags under the eyes, it actually works against fine lines and wrinkles, like it helps to get rid of it or prevent it. Um, this is also very skin tightening. I'm going to actually go over kind of like each product, what they do as fast, as best as I can. I can't go over every detail because this video will go on forever. But first I'm going to start with lip oil because my lips get dry so this routine i like to do morning and night the the routine i'm showing you guys right now is literally morning and night i do both so this lip oil is by perfectly posh i'm not really selling anymore but my account is still active so if you guys want to check it out let me know but that's not what this video is about um but yeah i love their lip oils so I started with the lip oil. Also, I already washed my face um, and I brushed my teeth, of course. It's morning. Whether you wanna brush your teeth or not, that ain't my business. <laughs> but for this skin, skincare routine, you wanna do it right after you either shower and wash your face or just wash your face in general. So I've already washed my face. Next, I'm gonna use this Witch Hazel for, um, it's a natural estrogen. It's for face and body. This brand right here is helps oily, irritated, red, damaged skin, blemished skin, or inflamed skin. So I get one of these and I just pour a little bit on there. This will also help, well obviously it helps to get rid of the like the redness. I have a mirror over here to my side. I like to start in this area because I have a lot of redness right here ever since my pregnancy. To those of you that have been here long, you already know. Oh, and also after this video, I'm actually going to film a quick uh, get ready with me video, like a quick makeup tutorial. That one's next. So if you guys want to see that video, subscribe because that one's coming up next within the next, you know, day or couple days. I'm filming it today for sure. So it is coming. But when will I upload it? I'm not sure yet. But it's definitely going to be within the week next couple days okay so I like to let that dry I'm gonna use two toners today you don't have to do this it's just like what I like to do because the witch hazel is good for all the irritated skin and everything um, it's also good for blemishes like uh, acne so you, it helps to prevent acne but the rose water let me see if I can really quickly uh, go over what the rose water does. Actually, like here's the rose water that I use. It says rose water facial toner is an oil free hydrating formula, so it's very hydrating, that gently removes debris and re residue to help refine and refresh your natural and healthy glow. This super humectant toner features hyaluronic acid, which I believe that's the one that helps with fine lines and wrinkles. Um, Sodium PCA rose petal essence and aloe vera for a petal soft and radiant complexion formulated to help refresh nourish and tone the skin by combating dryness invigorating dermal circulation 
diminishing the overall appearance of fine lines and refining pores. So I don't even have to look it up. This said it. So I already have it in here. It's this is pure just rose water. Um, I didn't add anything else to this. So I like to, this one doesn't mist very well. It's one of those um, glass bottles. So I got to kind of do it from far. That's how I do it. And then I like to, you can use a cotton like this, like what I just did. But I just like to use my hands for this one. I like to leave it on the skin. I don't like to wipe this one away. So the witch hazel, basically that toner was, that's going to do after you wash your face and if you use like one of these reusable or a cotton swab <sighs> gotta catch my breath <laughs> that one's actually gonna remove anything left over that your face your face wash did not remove so the rose water it's just i like to leave that one on so it's pretty they dry pretty quickly okay so next now this is where i'm going to look up some information for you guys i have here lavender essential oil but this is actually an empty bottle it's not empty now but i'm going to get to that so this is an empty bottle of lavender I still have rose water on my <laughs> um what i like to do is i put this in here all the way to the top this is a half half an ounce 0.5 fluid ounces so i fill it up to the top and then i get lavender essential oil i use this brand the vitamin shop brand i believe it was the vitamin shop in here so all this of grape seed oil and then five drops of lavender essential oil that's what's in here so i'm gonna go ahead and move this aside because actually no i'm not gonna move it aside because i'm gonna go over the benefits and then here we have rose hip oil is pure and natural organic cold pressed both of these are cold pressed and like all natural so i'm gonna go over what they do the benefits so the grapeseed oil has a ton of benefits this is good for the hair skin face everything i'm gonna just go really quickly over the you know the parts the the, the purposes that i use it for so it does lighten the dark circles it says Grapeseed oil is an effective and cost-friendly alternative to eye cream being that grapeseed oil contains, it's like a high amount of vitamin E in it. So, you know, it has moisturizing fatty acids, blah, blah, blah. So for dark eye circles, it promotes hair growth, which um, I'm not sure if you guys know that I why I shave my hair off, um, but I can link that video below so you guys can see that video. And I'm actually letting it grow out again so it does promote hair growth so i have been using it in my hair it moisturizes um it says being that grapeseed oil has anti-inflammatory inflammatory properties contains high levels of linoleic acid and doesn't clog pores so that's another reason why i love it for my face it is a commonly used moisturizer for acne prone and sensitive skin while many oils tend to leave behind a residue, grapeseed oil instantly dries upon application, making a great base for under makeup. That's another one. This is perfect to use right before you apply your makeup. Grapeseed oil also fades scars because it is rich in vitamin E and you know has other things. I'm not going to go over every detail, but it also prevents sun damage. It alleviates spider veins for anybody that has that. All right, sorry guys, something went on with my other camera. I don't know if the memory card's full or what, but I don't have time to deal with that right now. So I got my other camera, my Canon G7X. Back to where we were. The last thing that I caught was that it alleviates vitamins. It also tightens the skin, um, cause it is it has strong antioxidants. It increases, it says grape seeds increase collagen production. So that's also amazing. It reduces the appearance, appearance of fine lines and stretch marks. When applied topically to the skin or taken via supplement, grapeseed oil promotes healthy, youthful looking skin, as well as improves the skin's overall elasticity. Um, so the lavender essential oil also helps with a lot of those, like with everything I just said, I know that lavender is excellent for all that, which is why I combine both of them together. Now, really quickly, I'm going to go over rosehip oil. Okay, so the benefits of the rosehip oil really quick again it it hydrates so it's very hydrating for the face it's moisturizing it helps exfoliate and brighten the skin 
It helps to boost collagen. It helps to reduce inflammation, um, which also it says with this in mind, rosehip oil may calm irritating results from rosacea, psoriasis, eczema, and, and dermatitis. It helps protect against sun damage. It helps reduce hyperpigmentation. So like a sunspot that I got here, it has actually been improving. Um, it also helps reduce scars and fine lines. It helps boost immunity and, and so on. So as you guys can see, all three of these together are so good for you, including the rose water, um, the witch hazel. So all of this combined is just the best. So I'm going to show you guys how I do it. So again, moving this out of the way. So now we're left with just the two, the grapeseed oil with the lavender and the rosehip oil. The way I do it is like this. So I do three drops of the rosehip oil. And then this one, I just kind of pour a little bit to where it looks equal with the other one. Um, yeah, there you go. There, so it's like kind of like an equal amount. And then I mix it with any fingertip, it doesn't matter. So you mix it, you go like this. So once you have it spread on both hands, I like to start right here with this finger and then on the top with another one. I focus on here first because that's where you have your dark circles and your fine lines and all that. Then I like to go like that and spread it out. And be gentle. It looks like I'm being rough, but I'm not. Maybe I am. You're supposed to be gentle on your skin because um, you don't want to break the, I don't know, the skin cells. I am a doctor. I've said that before. <laughs> and then I like to bring it down to your neck and chest. And it will absorb really fast. But again, if you're going to apply makeup, this is the best thing to do right before your makeup. I would wait like five minutes after applying it so it absorbs really good. And then go ahead and start with your makeup. Which, that's my next one. My next step. I'm not going to do it on this video, but you guys will get to see it too. And it smells so good. This is also the best thing to do at night because of that lavender. So not only are you, you know, taking care of your skin and preventing fine lines and wrinkles, but you're also going to relax from the lavender. I love using this at night. Now, yeah, I know I said I haven't been sleeping good. That's because I've got a lot of stress on me lately, but this does help. Without the days that I have forgotten to do this routine, um, for whatever reason, those are the nights that I really don't get sleep. So the lavender does help. So there you go. That's it. And um, you won't see the effects right on camera because it does take a couple minutes for it to um, get rid of the dark circles, but it does. I think it's already improved a lot. If I go like that, the shade from the lights, but I think it's already working. It does work pretty fast. And that is it. And then the the leftovers is good to use like on your hands or your body if you're doing it right after the shower. Oh, yes. This stuff, oh my gosh. You do want to put it like for any mommies um, or people that have recently had like weight loss that, you, you know, they have gotten stretch marks. This is excellent for stretch marks. I've been using it on me. Um, so this is good for your entire body. So I got this on Amazon and um they actually have like a gallon five gallons i think is the most but um they sell these by the jugs like big gallons and it's the best oil you can use to fry you can literally fry it's for high heat um so it's good internally and externally so yeah you want to get that oil it's the best they say it's even better than olive oil and olive oil is really good for you you guys know that but this is even better so I hope this video was helpful to you guys, especially you guys that have been messaging me and asking me for this routine and tutorial. 
So if you guys have any questions, just leave them in the comments below. I will get back with you guys as soon as I see the messages. And I thank you for watching this video. And um, again, subscribe. Please hit like if you enjoyed this video and was informative for you guys. And stay tuned for my makeup tutorial that's next. Bye, guys.